All right, what is going on guys? Welcome back to Too Much Tech. And today we're gonna to be taking a look at Apex Legends and how to improve your overall experience and get more FPS out of the game on PC. What a lot of people have been noticing is that this game gets stuck at 144 frames per second. But for some of us that have monitors that refresh faster than 144 frames a second, like 240 frames a second, we want more frames and the game has us locked down. So how, one, do you view your FPS to see exactly what FPS you're getting at the time that you're playing? And two, how do you unlock your FPS? So the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is be able to view your FPS to see if your FPS is locked or not. So to do that, all you gotta do is go to Origin up here at the top, Application Settings, go to Origin In Game, and then scroll down to where it says Display FPS Counter. It's initially gonna say don't display, but you can change it to whatever portion of the screen you want it to show. So I picked the top right because that's what most games, um, the in-game FPS counter is usually in the top right. So I picked the top right. You can change the size, you can change the transparency. I just left it like that because I think it's fine. So that is how you're able to view your FPS to see what FPS you are getting and to see if your PC can handle running it over the max frame cap, which is like 144 frames a second. So to raise the FPS cap, first things first, what you gotta do, you gotta go over to your NVIDIA control panel, just right click on your empty desktop and it should say AMD Catalyst or something like that, Radeon Catalyst, I think, or NVIDIA control panel. In this case, it's gonna be NVIDIA control panel. Then I wanna go to manage 3D settings and go to vertical sync and disable vertical sync. All right, now that you have disabled VSync, there is one more thing that we have to do before we go in game. So you're gonna right click where it says Apex Legends, go down to where it says Game Properties and click on that. And this little window is gonna pop up, gonna hit Advanced Launch Options and click that. Then you're gonna type in plus FPS underscore max space unlimited. Then you're gonna hit save. After that, you should be all good to go. So you just click on Apex Legends and now we're gonna see what FPS we get in game. Now, if you do want to lower your maximum FPS, like for example, if your monitor only goes to like 60 Hertz or 75 Hertz or 100 Hertz, you can do that same command as long as it's anything under 144. So if it's 144, you can make that your cap. If it's 100, you can make 100 your cap. But if you do like 180 or something funky, you have to change it to unlimited. So you can't do it at a specific interval if it's above 144. All right guys, so as we can see, it's going over. It's finally going over 144 FPS in game. So it worked, we're all good to go. Only problem is that this game is not, it's not necessarily hard to run, but just we are running this on a Hey, chill, chill, brother, chill. Got the game to run at higher than 144 FPS. We got it to run at unlimited. So we were just hovering at like 170. This game is a little CPU intensive and like this uh, Threadripper, this Ryzen Threadripper is not the uh, the strongest. Oh, 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 get out of here, kid, kiddo. There we go. Now, we're, like, see, look, like we're looking out in the distance and now we can hit like 200 or something FPS. It's freaking crazy, man. But Ryzen obviously is not the, uh, you know, the strongest processor you can get as far as like single core performance. So like, obviously you need an Intel to like consistently hit like that high of FPS. And you probably want to have your settings on like really, really low too. So um, yeah, that is pretty much gonna wrap up the video, you guys. If you guys want to know how to unlock your frame weight, this is how you do it. And I hope that this works out for everyone. So if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new. I hope you guys are enjoying Apex Legends, and I will catch you guys in the next video.